everyone welcome to yalpedia education so today i am here with one very exciting phd position and this video is very important for those folks who completed their masters in signal processing wireless communication sensors and networks or those who are about to complete their master in the coming month of june and july so you can see here University of Texas at Dallas, they do have one PhD position available with them and that is with wireless communications and radar sensing lab. And guys, this is a fully funded position, no GRE required and no IS and TOEFL is being required by the university site. So what are the description, opportunity for PhD position in radar sensing and wireless communications are available within the electrical and computer engineering program at the University of Texas starting in fall 2024 or spring 2025. So they have told the priorities will be given for the candidate who possess master degree from electronics department and very important point they are asking you to have some good courses and some good hands on exposure on the ML machine learning. It's clearly written here experience in signal processing and machine learning and their application preferably in radar sensing and wireless communication and next experience in software defined radios interested applicants are encouraged to apply and explore the exciting opportunity available in our program graduate assistantship with full tuition fee waiver are available for qualified student GRE score is not required if your education language during your bachelor's or master's was in English, a TOEFL score or IELTS score is not required as well. And the professor name is Nura Torlak and he mentioned his email ID here. He told that please connect this professor with your CV and with your resume. So guys that is why we always keep on suggesting you people here at the Yorkpedia Global that it's very important to share your profile with the professors who are right now actively contributing into those research area which you are having you know some masters or you are having some bachelor or you are holding some specialization so that you can align your future aspiration with the requirement of that professor very effectively and see guys if you are about to pass out from any of the Indian institution doesn't matter you are from the NIT you are from the IIT or you are from the lower colleges if you possess the required skill if you got some hands-on exposure of the machine learning then you are the best fit candidate and it's a fully funded position with tuition fee waiver they are clearly mentioned and no GRE required and no English proficiency exam required from the university side if you completed your higher education in the English obviously our entire masters and bachelor in India they are in the English language only right so this is one of the excellent positions so now what you need to do you need to just make your CV and craft your CV in well appropriate way you need to write CV in such a way that there are prerequisites. Your experience in signal processing and machine learning must be reflected there in CV in a proper way so that when professor is reading your CV, he can assess your potential. Okay, you got some prior skill as per his requirement and you may be the you know good fit or best fit for this position and this is the process what happened behind the closed door of the graduate committee and how basically the professor made decision in the international university or abroad thank you people if you face any kind of the difficulty during this entire process how to fill your application and they may ask you multiple other documents statement of purpose they may ask you to write personal statement they may ask you to write academic statement it may happen that tomorrow they find your profile interested and they may ask you to connect on the zoom for brief introduction for conversation they want to know more about you they want to dive in depth about your profile till now they know you only through the cv now they want to connect in person with you then what kind of question they will ask how one should prepare for the interaction with the professor that all mentorship is being provided on the platform of the Yorkpedia Global by the you know expert mentors of Global who themselves are currently pursuing their PhD abroad and what we do for all the aspirant every day sorry every week twice once on Thursday and once on Saturday we conduct the free session one-on-one -on -one mentoring session 
where you can connect with the mentors they will be assessing your profile they will be doing your profile evaluation and they will tell you as per your profile or as per your credential what is the best fit for you at this moment which research area as per your project internship and skill you must go for and which university you must target you should focus on european university you, you should focus on usa that all factors are being discussed there in those sessions so they are important session for those folks who are willing to fly abroad and they are aspiring to do something significant contribution in the existing research library of our country so i wish you all the best don't miss this position one of the very prestigious position and great opportunity especially for those students who are about to pass out in this session immediately once you pass out you may get some position with excellent funding in the usa thank you